I can't believe I let a dude follow me home, but it makes for a good story. Hi friends, hello, hi. It's been a million years since I have vlogged. I've also, it's about 100 degrees in my car, literally it says 100 and I have the AC blasting because I'm sweaty. It's the like second day of summer solstice, but also it's my first day of like summer break. So the nature of my job apparently is like, you get like months breaks. So I wanted to vlog my summer because I wanted to be productive and I feel like whenever I do vlogs, it's productive. I just don't know how to not work because I've worked all my life since I was like 16. So I don't know how to take breaks unless it's like going on vacation. The plan today is to go to Box Lunch, which is a town over. I'm looking for a mini backpack to take to Disney World because I'm going on vacation next month. And so I'm back in the house. Um, I went to get this coupon from Box Lunch because it has 25% off and so why not? I didn't know this, but you can go on Amazon and buy like the covers of these and I literally just replaced it. I got a yellow one because I thought it was fun and bright and like I could distinctly find it. Okay, I'm gonna go to Box Lunch now and TJ Maxx and Home Goods because I'm trying to also redo my patio because I want to spend more time outside um, and just have another place to hang out with while I just chill for the summer. So come on, let's go. pets. I would totally get this. Okay, so this is my outfit. You can see all of the curves better like. It's okay. Painted my toes white. Never done this before, but I always see people do it, so I wanted to do it for the summer. It is 6.04 in the afternoon, the evening. Um, I'm going to Lowe's because I wanted to get planters and I also need to get cilantro because we're having fish tacos tonight. But I also wanted to share with you guys Joe Bro's new song, Jonas Brothers. They had a song called um, Remember This. I want to play it. I had to like do something because my neighbor like went into his car and like left. So I had to act like I wasn't filming myself because I feel pretty awkward. I haven't vlogged in quite a long time. Obviously, I haven't posted a lot. I wanted to share this sunblock and this is from Supergoop. It's the Unseen Sunscreen. This one I've been using for about two months now and um, you have to apply this every 40 minutes. So every time I like go in my car, I just reapply it. Um, I only apply it on like my bare skin. I haven't applied it on top of makeup. I have no makeup on because I'm gonna put on a mask. Even though Virginia lifted the mask mandate, I still prefer to wear a mask just cause even though I'm fully vaccinated, like you never know and I'm not trying to get sick cause I have trips I'm trying to go to. So it's known for um, not being visible. Like you know, regular sunscreens give you that white cast and your girl is dark and I don't want to have like a like a ghost flashback look. I didn't really do much today. I just basically um, just bullet journaled and then watched Hamilton. And then I finally pushed myself to go to the gym, which was really great. I did the 12 um, incline for three speed for 30 minutes. I used to do that all the time, but now it's like super popular on TikTok. And it just reminded me to do that. So I did that. I did some cardio and then I lifted weights, which I really like. Um, I'm not good at it anymore because I haven't lifted weights in a very long time. But I also did the like reverse ab workout where you like hold weights and then like 
basically March um, and that I saw says that it helps your core more and I hate doing like ab workout hence why I don't have a flat stomach I hate doing crunches because I have scoliosis and it hurts my back when I like do crunches so we're gonna go to Lowe's my intention for Lowe's is to buy a side railing planter and buy like flowers for it because I just want to make the patio pretty here we go although the garden center is there maybe I'll just go that way zoom on this thing but there's a love seat over there and I want it but I can't fit it in my car small car problems like I love my small compact car but I like move so much and I buy so much like furniture that I need like a bigger car better like I'm not gonna buy a new car just because I want to buy a love seat for the patio but it's the perfect price. It's on sale right now and I want to buy it. But yeah, I bought plants. Ah, the thing I don't like about this Osmo is that it only focuses on my face. It doesn't let me show you what I want to show you, but I guess I, I'll just flip the camera. Okay. I bought these begonias and then I think this is another type of begonia. Look at this lightly, y'all. Wow. Of course, when I vlog, is when someone goes in their car that's right next to me. Awkward. Anyways, I'm hungry. It's like dinner time. So I'm gonna go to Food Lion because I still need to get the cilantro and sour cream. Good morning. It is 9.14. Today I'm going to Northern Virginia to go try some mochi donuts. I am so excited because I've been craving mochi donuts since <clears throat> I moved out of southern california and i guess they only have them there and in like hawaii so this is the only mochi donut like seller in the dmv that i know of um dmv means uh delaware maryland and virginia so i'm headed there it's quite far so it's gonna take me about two hours but i'm also meeting my friend faith which um, you guys have probably seen her in like my previous vlogs. We went to New York together and that was really great and she used to be in a lot of my vlogs before. Um, but she moved up to Nova so I'm going to go see her and we're gonna have a Nova day. So yeah, I'm excited to do all the foodie things because it's been a while. So let's go to Nova. I want it all. <laughs> <laughs> Is that too much? <laughs> <laughs> you have like oh, one, two, three, four, four, five, six. <laughs> I was like, do you, do you have everything? Okay, I'll report you. <laughs> no, but like, I'm kind of gonna. <laughs> okay, 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 cool. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. This was worth the 
two hour drive. <laughs> I woke up so early today, I was like, I'm ready for donuts. Oh yeah. It's like a good sharing. Um, <laughs> no, this, this is all for me. <laughs> wow, we inhaled that. <laughs> oh, but. How much did you pay for her bar? 32. 32. 32. Okay, is this sweet? It's very sweet. sweet. Very sweet? Mm -hmm. Never mind. But it's good. I <laughs> they, mean, they, they have plain ones. Yeah, they have plain. Um, and then I think maybe the other flavors weren't as sweet. Ah. But strawberry is, is sweet. Thank you. You're welcome. It's my first time to come, but today I'm going to bake it. I have about that. That's why. Yeah, me too. It's our first time. <laughs> okay, have fun. Bye. Take me like a little free appetite. I need a brand deal. <laughs> come on now. We'll sit here. Donuts. We'll sit here all day. I do for you. <laughs> <laughs> No, I've never read it. I don't know how to say, I don't know how to do the Korean accent. I do? I do. You ever watch that Joe Boy special when you yeah. like Well I don't He's like Korean. No, that's Japanese. <laughs> What's Korean? Oh, they sound like ghosts. Oh. It's all the flavors. <laughs> Hello! I'm a terrible vlogger, but basically my friend Faith and I went to a park and just talked for a couple hours just to hang out. And then I just got out of Ben Gong's tea and I got this Chinese style mango pudding cheese tea. Sorry for my dirty car, but that's what it looks like. And then I got some for on the road and then I'm taking home the mochi donuts cause I for sure wasn't gonna finish all of those by myself. Okay, well, I'm gonna go now, bye. Hi everyone, it is Friday, um, I am gearing myself towards going to the gym. I'm not in the best shape of my life, but that's why we go to the gym, right? Um, I have a headache, I think because of all the sweets that I ate yesterday. Um, my head is just like aching. So I took an ibuprofen and I figured maybe a good workout would help with the headache. I didn't vlog like the rest of the trip from yesterday. Basically, we just hung out at a park. It was a beautiful park. I should have taken a photo, but I forgot to. And we just like, my friend Faith and I just talked and caught up and, you know, had like a, a therapy session of just like talking to each other about life. And then I went home and watched One Tree Hill because I'm on a One Tree Hill kick. Yeah, that's basically why I'm working out. I'm going to Florida in like two weeks, so it's not like I'm gonna see major differences, but you know, getting active, staying active is important. Okay, I guess I should stop stalling and go to the gym now. Say hello. <laughs> okay, I'm doing the 12 for 30 minutes for three inclines. Hi. And then I'm gonna go lift weights after. Okay. I did it, I went to the gym. You can do better. Let me show you what a good time looks like. You can do better. So much better. TJ Maxx because my mom got a gift card from one of our aunties and she let me have the gift card so I'm gonna go use it because I'm trying to update our um, patio so I don't know if you can see but my passenger seat behind me is like laid way back because I'm going to attempt 
to fit this love seat patio chair in my car today but I'm really determined to have it in my car I think it can fit we shall see I actually walked out with nothing for our patio okay so I wanted to show you guys what I got from TJ Maxx I got this planter which I have in white I like the terracotta color and then I got this travel organizer. I'm really excited about this purchase because it's Rifle Paper Co, which is my favorite. It's a tumbler and it holds hot and cold drinks. It's also in this like really cute print and it's a corkle. I also got these like really comfortable jersey material shorts. There's this pink one that has like the trimming at the end. And it also comes with this like gray floral print, which I really like. And then I got this top right here. And this is like an apron style shirt. And I really like the embroidery. Oh my God, I almost had a freaking heart attack because prior to this clip, I guess I had dropped my wallet somewhere. This little thing fell out of my hands like in between me paying and me getting in my car and I didn't notice. And then the next thing I know, I'm at Marshall's, which is like two miles away, and um, I didn't have my wallet. It wasn't in my little fanny pack. To the good Samaritan that returned it to the front, thank you so much. I will probably never meet you. Okay, you can't see it, but that was Lowe's. Um, so I went to Marshall's, and I got the table that I was looking for, a dress and i met my friend kimmy um so i'm going to a cookout with her at her house tomorrow so that'll be cute but i parked way in the back um i'm gonna attempt to buy this freaking uh chair and shove it in my car i hope it fits i think it will we shall see this is the chair i'm trying to get in my car i think it'll fit i don't it's huge Okay guys, story time for you. I'm literally getting followed by a Lowe's employee because he watched me shove the thing in the car and it couldn't fit. And he's watched me for like 20 minutes and he's offered to drop it off at my house. And I took it because I believe in Good Samaritans today. Yeah, this is the wildest thing I've ever done. But his name is Sam. He's a Lowe's employee. He has a Honda Pilot, so it's a big ass car. That's really nice of him. Wow, what a Friday. He's much older. He has gray hair. He's wearing a cactus shirt that has like different type of cactuses, like small cactuses all over and like blue pants, brown dress shoes. That's his description. <laughs> I'm just putting this out here just in case. Wow, I, I can't believe I let a dude follow me home. I don't do this at all, but I really want this chair. <laughs> you guys, I'm crazy. Don't do this, I don't recommend you do this. But it makes for a good story. It's this freaking median. If it wasn't this median, I would have fit it in my car because I'll, I'll show you a picture. It got really in there. And then he was like, okay, um, how far do you live? And I was like, I literally live like five minutes away. And he's like, oh, well, I have to go home anyways. Um, I can help you, I'm off the clock. If you see his bright lights, that's like flashing on my face, reflecting on the mirror. Yeah, that's, that's the dude following me. Watch, I, I freaking bring it home and it doesn't fit in the patio because it's actually bigger than I remembered. He probably feels so weird. I wonder what's going on in his mind. Like, but wow, like 20 out of 10 service. Okay. So he gave me his business card so he's like legit he was working at a different location and the guy that works at this location actually quit and so he's been covering for the dude um for like both places he was off the clock and he was like watching me struggle and he was like you were almost there and it was about to rain, which funny enough, it, it's not raining anymore, but it was legit like drizzling. It was so awkward. Cause like, I was like, okay, thank you. This is it. And he was like, you tell me what to do. And I was like, okay, um, you can drop it off here. And I like waited for him to leave, but he had to like fix his car back to like its normal order because he like 
disheveled it just so my chair could fit. Good Samaritan though, wonderful guy. Shout out to Sam. Um, and yeah, he was also on the phone with someone. So I'm sure he was like, uh, I'm coming home late. I'm helping this crazy woman back to bring her patio furniture in her house. But yeah, that was like the nicest thing ever. Like shout out to all the Good Samaritans today. One with my wallet and one with bringing this chair into my apartment complex. Okay, well, I'm hungry. It's 8.38, so it's like hella late, but it's still pretty bright out. Let's go fix my patio. Let's go. Do you hear that? That's, I think, a frog. You can do better. Let me show you what a good time looks like. You can do better.